So I owe you explanation. What is Kashubian and what is Amber? On the southern shores of the Baltic Sea, in Poland, province Pomerania, there are living Kashubian people. Kashubians make their living by fishing, hunting, um, farming, gathering amber, or oh, they gather honey of the wild bees, and amber, which is plentiful on the seashores of the Baltic. Kashubian figure out the healing properties of amber very early. According to archaeological discoveries, there were found ornament made of amber, like a crosses, uh, some talisman, something, which uh, was aged to Neolithic age. That means 10,000 years before Common Era. So that's how long Kashubian lives by the, in Pomerania. Polish province Pomerania, and Gdańsk, my city where I was born, is the capital city of Pomerania. Mm -hmm. Now, about Amber. Mm -hmm. Oh, I owe you something more about Kashubian. Mm -hmm. You see, Kashubian pass their culture, customs, language, orally, from generation to generation. They gather at evenings, winter evenings, and storytellers were sharing richness of experience and their wisdom. And that's how, without written word, the language was passed on. Only in the middle of 19th century, the printed literature appeared in Kashubian language. So, you can gather that Kashubians are natural storytellers, right? Mm -hmm. Now about amber. Amber is a magical healing property having stone. Stone. Actually, this is the resin of the pine trees fallen by glacier into the Baltic Sea under the pressure of salty water forming 40 million years laying there, that means amber became fossilized stone, which was used as a healing stone. You can make, uh, uh, dissolve it only in spiritus, that means the strongest of alcohols, and then drops of it is healing. You can wear amber on your heart and it will act as a peacemaker, because it has negative ions, so it is healing. Amber was traded by Kashubians with Arabs, Egyptians. Oh, Egyptians used amber to mummify dead people with the embalming and making them prepared for burial. But Kashubians use amber to preserve fish. When they were smoking fish, they throw some pieces of amber into the fire, and that's how they preserved fish. And amber's supernatural properties were tested this way. When the dish would be made from amber, and somebody would put poison food or drink into it, dish will crack open fall apart. That's how healing power has amber. Then they made um, some crosses, rosaries, jewelries, everything, and amber still has that. Baltic amber has special properties because of those pine trees, which resin has natural healing power. So that would be enough about amber. You can touch and see later on. Now to the story.